I need my card, the keys, and the fob, and the ring. Why? I found out that you were transgender. <laughs> Welcome back. Recently, I stumbled across this clip on Twitter. Though a lot of people say it is fake. How possible you can date somebody for months and you don't realize he is not a girl. I don't know how true this is. Watching this video several times, I'm trying to be convinced something is going on. I don't want to talk much. I will play the video so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. If you have not subscribed, please do. If possible, why not share this video? God bless you as we dive straight into this clip. The the fog, and the rain. Why? I found out that you were transgender. You've been lying to me since the start. No, I haven't. Yeah. But, okay. We I'm, have not gonna, I'm not gonna argue with you. Can you can take all your stuff out of the problem. I don't care. I'm not gonna argue I'm not with you. You're trying to be an asshole about it. Like I said, I'm not gonna argue with you. Here we go. You need the key in the closet too. I gotta return to the office. I'll like. return it. Thank you. I'll return it. Please, I need it. Like I said, you can get your stuff out of the apartment. You're not gonna do anything to your stuff. Don't That's care. Fine. Okay, take it out. I'm not gonna change the way you feel. I'm not gonna do anything. You know, when I watched this clip, uh, something just came through my mind. Is it that they are acting what exactly? From the clip, you will see it clearly. They have been living together in the same apartment for months. Then this man has never realized he was a man. Then I asked so many questions, you know, having intimacy, taking the bath, you will see it clearly, you know, even the cut of the manhood, you know, try to insert the womanhood in him, you will see it. That is a question that puzzled in my mind. Because it is, you know, I don't see how feasible I can stay with a man pretending to be a woman, I will not realize within the first, even the first day. Yeah. So, telling me or trying to convince me that this is not just acting, you know, I still can't believe this is reality. Yeah. Because even with these surgeries that these people carry out, you know, it is artificial. Like you take the manhood, you try to invert it, you always need to, you know, I don't want to go to describe what happened because I've watched a lot of videos where people try to explain, you know, situations like this. So seeing this man getting furious and angry, you know, it's something I don't understand. I just feel like that's that's disrespectful, Hennessy, because it's just like, bro. But me, but me and you had a discussion earlier. About okay, but you, you on the live now. What, what, Why do you feel like, like okay? The thing I don't like doing is, is repeating the same thing over and over. Me and um, well, you have a lot of people homes that you destroy, so it's out of people. That's not your business. Oh, that's not your business? No, it's not. I don't got shit to do with me. That don't have shit to do with you. But you're exposing you people. Talk, they had this talk earlier. You said you and you said you was gonna come on a live, and you said we did have a talk, and, and you, you said you was gonna come on a live. Stop making it seem like we had a different conversation. I'm gonna let you know everybody know what conversation we had. Different conversation because I literally told you I said we mean you have two different opinions of how we do shit. Okay, and I told you, I told you to come on a live and tell your side of the story. And I, said, I will, but not right now because I'm still looking through these pictures. That's what I'm not saying. right now, and this ain't got nothing to do with you. Be honest. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so like all the niggas you posted, did they know you was a? You honest with them or you wasn't honest with them? 
Mm-hmm. No, when I got my shit removed, I ain't need to feel. I ain't like work. Oh, you feel like, like you didn't need to tell nobody? That's not your place. Mm-hmm. I cut it off, so it was like niggas don't give a fuck. Like niggas fucking put like what? Like, I get what you're saying. I ain't never, I ain't, I ain't never in a relationship with these niggas. These niggas are trying to spend a life the rest of their life. I mean, we just trying to hit and cut it. Why the fuck I'ma sit here and say some dumb shit like, oh yeah, this is. Like, what? Like, I don't nigga want to hear that. You know, bullshit like that. And if I was a nigga, I wouldn't even really give a fuck. If I was a nigga, if, like, if I put the bitch... But you have to be honest, though. Know. You playing with people's lives and stuff like that. I'm not playing with nobody's life because they, they're not those... Not, these, are not, these are not important people in my life. These people that I'm in, they're not... They, and the niggas I'm meeting in my life, they're not my husband. They're not my name. These are hidden and crazy. I understand, so but you got to be... You know, you got to be honest, but it's okay, though. But my, So my question to you is... All the niggas you post, so you this, is just all, this is just all about like perspective and like opinion. Like, true, that's real. That's real. Way. That's you real. That way, like yeah, and I understand. I understand that perspective. A lot of people would agree with you, yes, but a, pe- a lot of people would also agree with me. You know, this is like a city girl generation. So <laughs> don't know bitch give a fuck about them. Like the bitches give a fuck about money. So if I'm getting paid, or I'm gonna sit here and try to jeopardize me getting paid by telling you some shit that don't even really matter. Like, if I'm gonna get paid, I'm not gonna... So you feel like you know. being a nigga and you two don't matter? This is a city girl generation. Oh, okay. I don't give a fuck about no nigga. You heard that? <laughs> you know, this is just a situation struggling to justify if this person slept with this. This is a big problem happening in our society today where some people even see the strands you know they get confused they even went for that to do some tests to check if he actually did this so like i said based on your polygraph test i have to say you never had to have a fantasy in any way whatsoever okay all right you all right Yes, God bless you for watching me. There is one thing I want to share with you. Yes, going through my comment section, there is something I realize with people. We need to have a voice. Consider the people we are watching today, the big content creators. In some years to come, they will not be there. Yes. They imagine that, okay, everybody's afraid. Meaning that time, we will not have people that will be able to speak up in the society. So, the time is now. I said on my previous video, I'm a fighter and I will continue to be a fighter. 